Good morning, and greetings to all Prince of Peace family. In the first letter of John, chapter 4, verse 16 through 18, we read, God is love. There is no fear in love, but perfect love drives out all fear. One of my favorite hymns of Prince of Peace is, Be Not Afraid. Do Not Be Afraid appears over 300 times in the Bible and mentioned twice in that brief reading from John this morning. Fear is part of our life. We fear getting old, we fear illness, we fear criticism, we fear being separated from our loved ones. We fear losing our job, perhaps, at this time in our community. Experts tell us that fear of death and isolation are the most common. Let me be honest. Fear is part of life. Early this year, I had a medical challenge, and I was scared because of it. Will I make it? Will I not? Fear, like the coronavirus, these things challenge us, and they challenge our very way of life. We may even question our belief in God. All these things should remind us that we are not guaranteed tomorrow. For all of us, these are challenging times, and all we need to do is what we're called to do. Remember, the only real power we have is in prayer and the grace of God. Fear is useless. What is needed is trust. Many people have gone to church all of their lives and never really heard the good news. The good news is very simple, that we are loved unconditionally by God. Well, at frequent times, we preachers give a message of fear and punishment and damnation. I have been one of those myself growing up I got a very twisted message of the gospel. But as I grew older and began reflecting on the scriptures and reading the stories of God's love in the New Testament, like the prodigal son, I came to a new awareness of God's love for me. That has affected my life greatly because love drives out all fear. So my prayer for you today is, may the Lord bless you and protect you. May his light shine upon you and be gracious unto you. And may Almighty God bless you, keep you in his love and care, and give you a sense of peace and harmony in your heart and home. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. God bless you all.